Harry caught slapping Meg on Hyatt Hotel Lobby after discovering Meg seduced Ted Sarandos at Beyonce's concert. How dare you? Meg trembles as Harry kicks her out of Invictus Games for luring Ted Sarandos. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle are eyeing a new multi-million dollar home in Malibu. After reporting it, they disturbed the neighbors. The couple discovered a luxury home on a plot of land near the coastal city nestled in the Santa Monica Mountains of Los Angeles. The proposed mansion is approximately 10,000 square feet and, if purchased, would become the Sussex's primary residence. Sources said poolside seating terraces and fire pits have been built on the site, but a construction cost to create a new business would cost a further 8 million pounds. It comes after Harry and Meghan reportedly disappointed neighbors at their current Montecito home in Santa Barbara. Most locals think that the mere presence of them has the paparazzi crazy, and the paparazzi surrounding their house and the sound of helicopters flying overhead due to living near Harry and Meghan, people's privacy is being violated. One disgruntled local said the proposed new land would be less than an hour from L.A. and would allow the Sussexes to rub shoulders with more famous locals. These include the likes of Oscar-winning actor Leonardo DiCaprio and Paris Hilton. Interestingly, though, there are rumors that Meghan Markle is looking for a new home in Malibu to be closer to Netflix CEO Ted Sarandos and even Jeff Bezos, possibly with the intention of flirting with both of them after she was spotted sitting in the same box as Ted and Jeff. She will start flirting with any rich man she can. She may have a minute to talk to Ted Sarandos, who, by the way, has a net worth of $320 million. On October 10th, he and his wife also bought a beach house in Malibu from David for $10.2 million. Meanwhile, Meghan is seen forcing a bored Harry to move to Malibu and telling him to love it or leave it. According to Sky News, royal commentator Angela Levin, she said that the big change made Prince Harry depressed after the suit-wearing actress wanted to live closer to Hollywood. I don't think Harry wants to be in Malibu at all. They went and lived briefly in L.A., and he really hated it. He said he didn't want to be around famous people and thought that it was a pretty good statement for Meghan. He may like it, but the whole will grow longer as a result. Common suggests that the Duke of Sussex is currently scared and depressed because he doesn't want to leave Montecito to pursue a more Hollywood lifestyle. If he doesn't want to, then what is he going to do? He was scared. Now he's so depressed that he can stay. Well, I'm not going to come and stay in Montecito. She moved there because she was near a PR store and close to where all the deals were done. Speaking about the couple's Montecito home, she went on to say that it was Megan's dream home. However, she has a track record of never being satisfied with anything and is looking for another home in Malibu. It's a dream house. She wanted to be near the sea because she used to go there as a child. But when she got it, she didn't want it anymore. She wants something else. Levin said many people who know her have told us that she's never satisfied with anything. She manipulates situations and uses people until they are really